And this is the lesson in how not to camp. Or maybe this is the lesson to learn from so you know what to do when you go camping. Or if you want to have an adventure, follow our footsteps and just see where the road takes you. Man, yeah, you might you might not try that. since I've been able to say that. We've been just so busy. Getting the house ready. Working a lot of hours at work. I already said that in the last vlog, but it's true. Now it's time to pack up the car, slow down for a few days, then slow down for a few more days. The summer is here. The house is ready. The house is going up on the market. Being so excited, hoping that by the time we get back from vacation, by the time this vlog goes up, hopefully we will have some offers already in. Stay on top of this, see if you can follow this. Drink and swallow this from the hollow tips. Lost one skate with the quickness. Shake your head to this. Tell me if you're feeling this. If you all, let me know you all. Turn it up real loud, let the beat in your car. I'm the best by far, like my man Omar. Make a real loud noise, let me hear what you all. You know it? I said this is the moment of truth. We're gonna see if it says full or not. So the deal is that this is a campground that we just arrive. We don't have a reservation for. If there is a spot, we can take it. If there's no spot, go go look somewhere else. How are we looking so far? Are we going to be know. able to It said vacancy out front, but it's not looking promising in here. Well, let's just say that so far it's not looking good at all. Still not looking good. So, the no reservation campsite? That's a thumbs down. The truth of the matter is that if we would have gotten up earlier, which was hard because the hardware store didn't open, or not stopped as long, then we would have for sure gotten a spot at the campsite with no reservations. Now on to see if closer to the lake, where there are reservations, if anybody dropped out last minute. Possibly get some nights at this place, which is actually closer to the lake, <laughs> for two nights, and then Go oh, check out the other one. I'm trying to figure all that out. Right, shit gets slapped quick. Match wits work. Sell up the cracks like chapstick. Hot spit. Who get the purple pack with content? You never will have none like an empty. Okay, so we have a spot for two nights if we want it, but no more than two nights. The problem is here we have to set up, tear down and go over there and check that out it's a lot of work but that's way better than staying probably 25 30 minutes down the road now you may be asking the question how come we didn't make a reservation well making a reservation requires you to wait for the specific day that the reservations open up you have to get up early apparently getting up early is the problem Really, the situation was we needed to go to the hardware store to bring our bikes. That didn't open up until 8 o'clock. So that's why we didn't leave earlier. And I didn't go to bed until like 5.30. So... Convent, this musical bomb. All set your defense. Ain't been another competitor better than we since. Some of you brothers sound like repetitive recess. We release the repressed stress because we bless like... Little busy, little busy, Lovely lady, bump the 80s. Lovely lady, bump the 80s. Give your 
Um, you know, we haven't even set up our tent or anything. We just really it's lazy. time to be lazy for like just a little bit. But what I realized is camping, uh, we didn't have a spot. Mexico, we didn't know where we were going. Snow trip, snowed in, stuck on the road. We're just, we're really not having the best luck. Uh, what do I mean? Yeah. Uh, do you remember that time that we didn't know where we were going? Oh, we didn't, know where, we didn't know where the place was. Yeah. We yeah. didn't know okay. where the place was, hence we didn't know where we were. Yeah, I think that constitutes we didn't know where we were going. It was pretty dramatic when we, we were in the middle of it. Um, it's a little smelly and we had the tent. We were cleaning out the shed. The tent got put outside. The tent got wet. The tent was still folded up uh, and the tent got moldy. Uh, we've been working uh, the weekend before 4th of July, the weekend of 4th of July, 4th of July, the following weekend, and Monday and Tuesday. And so the time to really dedicate to all this stuff has been very little to nothing. So when we packed up last night, it was all stuff no food so kelly is on her way to go get food go get some of the utilities that we didn't have any space for in here but she's also buying a new tent what happened aj smacked you in the arm did you did you smack him back no oh that's good I'm proud of you. There aren't a lot of times that you get a chance to just play things by ear. Not have a plan and just go and do. If we're gonna do that, camping is one of the easy ones. Some travel, it's easy just to kind of fill in the gaps. Spontaneity, uh, just be prepared for changes, obstacles. Have a mindset of patience, especially with um, the, these, these guys. But as long as you have that, you're, you're gonna be you're gonna be good. Um, add insult to injury. It we're about half an hour, forty minutes away from like actual good uh, stores that we can stock up on food and those kinds of things. She gets down there, but we realize that she left her money here. So now she's trying to figure out if she can do Apple Pay. She doesn't have it set up, but she is working to get that set up. Honestly, I really think that it's just the lack of sleep for her and for me because just, I'm holding it together. I'm not irritable. Doing really good with the kids. But we're just not thinking very good. This is the doc. Period. We serious. Boy, you know what we got. This thing is so fire. Go please stay by. Break the street. So please press repeat. Go let me. So Kelly's not back, but she is on her way with food. A brief recap of the lessons that we've learned. One. Wake up early enough to be first come. So your first serve. Or two, make a reservation. Three, pack food. Four, remember your credit cards or cash when you go to the store 40 minutes away. Um, five, take the cooler with you when you're going to buy a bunch of food and ice instead of it being table. Six, matches well anyway i hope that you enjoyed this vlog it feels good to be back in rhythm thank you for liking sharing watching and subscribing and we will <gasps> who is that right there oh my goodness that timing is really and so roll credits and we're gonna end this vlog very soon this is just day one and you learned so much Right?
We learned so much.